it is 13th of august and the day is thursday class 10th a'udhu billahi minash shaitanir rajeem bismillahir rahmanir rahim rabbishrah li sadri wa yassir li amri wahlul uqdatan min lisani yafqahu qawli rabbi zidni ilma rabbi zidni ilma rabbi zidni ilma assalam alaikum students I hope you will be fine, students. If you did not complete your work on time, then what happened? Yes, then you can't get fruitful result. Okay, then let's start a lesson. Unit number seven. Little by little, one walks far. थोड़ा थोड़ा करके एक लंबा सफर तय हो जाता है. इट्स मीन वी कैन कम्प्लीट अवर कोर्सेज ऑफ स्टडी वेल इफ वी स्टडी दैम स्टडली एंड विद एफर्ट वी डिवेलप अवर पर्सनैलिटी इन स्टेजेस स्लोली सो स्टूडेंट्स का क्या मतलब हुआ कि अगर हम एक लंबे फासले को आसानी से तय कर लेते हैं कैसे जब उसे थोड़ा थोड़ा करके चलते जाए अब इस स्टडी के कोर्स को अच्छी तरीके से ख़त्म करते हैं साथ साथ देन क्या होगा वी डिवेलप अवर पर्सनैलिटी इन स्टेजेस स्लोली हम अपनी शख्सियत को तश्कील देते रहेंगे मुख्तलफ मराहल में कैसे होगा ड्यू टू कम्प्लीट अवर कोर्सेज ऑफ स्टडी वेल डे बाई डे इन एक्चुअल स्टूडेंट्स दी दिस एसे प्रजेंट्स दी ऑथर्स एटीट्यूड towards life this attitude is one of the struggle to learn what he can do even if the conditions of his life are unfavorable to to him or her then she or he must struggle to control the conditions so students let's start pre reading questions question number 1 is what do you understand by the topic लिटल बाय लिटल वन वॉक्स फॉर आपको इस चीज़ की क्या समझ आई कि लिटल बाय लिटल वन वॉक्स फॉर थोड़ा थोड़ा करके एक लंबा सफ़र तय हो जाता है कैसे कि फॉर एग्जांपल स्लोली एंड स्लोली इस्टेब्लिश्ड हिमसेल्फ हर सेल्फ एज एन इंडिपेंडेंट पर्सन वेदर शी इज आर ही इज ओके क्वेश्चन नंबर टू इज डू यू थिंक को करिकुलर एक्टिविटीज में प्रिपेयर स्टूडेंट्स फॉर द फ्यूचर आंसर इज येस आई थिंक सो बिकॉज को करिकुलर एक्टिविटीज हेल्प स्टूडेंट्स लर्न अलाउट ऑफ थिंग्स एंड दस प्रिपेयर दैम फॉर द फ्यूचर नेक्स्ट क्वेश्चन क्वेश्चन नंबर थ्री वट काइंड ऑफ को करिकुलर एक्टिविटीज डू यू लाइक एंड वाई स्टूडेंट्स it's your choice you have to do it um, yourself but i will tell you about co curricular activities that what are co curricular activities co curricular activities in schools and colleges are debating games scouting swimmings and uh, that are the outside the regular courses of study these uh, prepare the students to take part in social activities and to take Have positions of responsibilities in different departments and also different places. It also promotes fellowship, joint working, co cooperation, debates, and also social work. Now, students, let's start our lesson with paragraph number one. The last couple of some years have been a long, bumpy. right for me as the hey for everyone of my age the experiences might be different but everyone has gone through many of the same teenage circumstances as i have done all of them have dealt with them in their own way as a personal participant in this game we call life i would say i work hard for the first place and earned it that is just my creative view of things it is bad 
that the effect is that not everyone sees it in the same way as I do. Students, it means that a writer has travelled along the rough road. During the last few years, he has faced many problems in his own way. Uh, that uh, He says that I took part in this game of life and worked hard. I got the first position in this game. This is the writer's uh, inventive view of things in life. This means that he tells us about the writer's के कुछ सालों से उसकी जिंदगी की लंबी गैर हमवार मतलब उसने कुछ रोड पे ट्रेवल किया उसको बहुत मुश्किलात अपने अंदाज में मतलब उसको पेश आई कि मैंने उसने कहा कि मैंने जिंदगी के खेल में हिस्सा लिया जिंदगी के खेल में इन दिस इन द द गेम ऑफ लाइफ एंड वर्क हार्ड और उसने सख्त मेहनत की फिर उसने कहा मैं उसमें अव्वल आया आई गॉट फर्स्ट पोजीशन इन दिस गेम एंड uh, this is the writer's inventive. ये मुसनिफ की जिंदगी का एक तखली की नजारा था, inventive view था, एक अपनी एक creativity थी उसकी. So students, couple of, it is a noun and uh, its synonym is some or few. Bumpy, it is an adjective and its synonym is rough, jerky, uncomfortable. Ride, it is a noun and its synonym is journey. Uh, journey or trip uh, gone through um, and that is passed uh, through uh, teenage that is an adjective and uh, its synonym is um, of uh, children uh, means between 13 uh, 13th year to uh, 19 years that is the uh, age of uh, uh, that is the called the age of teenage circumstances that is the noun and its synonym is conditions dealt with that is the verb and its synonym is treated handled participant that is the noun and its synonym is participator or one taking part and that is the verb and its synonym is got with effort or won so let's start paragraph number two as a student i am an active participant in academic and co-curricular activities my first priority has always been to get good grades in school. Although this is important to me, I also know that by participating in sports and after school activities, I will become a well-rounded student. During the past years of my high school career, I participated in a seed awards in the following Kairiasm badge in scouting, winner of Who's Who quiz program, at the district level and academic excellence award while participating in inter-district declamation contest and essay writing competition for the year 2012-2011 i air i also belong to the following clubs reading club two years second year as a secretary reading club the computer club in the year 2009 i received awards in the following classes computer application geography and advanced algebra trigonometry i also received an award for the most encouraging students i currently belong to the hiking and outdoor club and the environmental awareness club in addition this year i participated in a program called read with a friend in this program i, I along with a group of other students went to nearby elementary school to read to a class of students from kindergarten to the fifth grade participant that is a noun and its synonym is one taking part in co-curricular that is an adjective and its synonym is outside studies or out, outside the classroom uh, activities noun uh, that is a noun and its synonym is drawings daily works uh, and acts priority that is a noun and its synonym is doing one thing before once or um, preferences after school activities act, uh, that is a noun and its synonym is after studies and uh, work in school well rounded that is an adjective and its synonym is well balanced career that is a noun and its synonym is working years receive that is a verb and its synonym is get or obtain awards that is a noun noun 
एंड इट्स एन एन अमेज प्राइज रिवॉर्ड ऑनर बेच दैट इज़ द नाउन एंड इट्स एन एन अमेज ग्रुप ऑफ पीपल आर थिंग्स द डिस्ट्रिक्ट लेवल दैट इज़ द नाउन एंड इट्स एन एन अमेज एट द लेवल ऑफ द डिस्ट्रिक्ट एंटर डिस्ट्रिक्ट दैट इज़ एन एडजेक्टिव एंड इट्स एन एन अमेज बिटवीन टू डिफरेंट डिस्ट्रिक्ट डिक्लेमेशन दैट इज़ अ नाउन एंड इट्स सनम इज मेकिंग हाई स्पीच डिस्कशन थ्रू स्पीच आर एनी हाउ कॉन्टेस्ट दैट इज़ अ नाउन एंड इट्स सनम इज कॉम्पिटिशन डिबेट बिलोंग टू दैट इज़ अ वर्ब एंड इट्स सनम इज वॉज कनेक्टेड विद और वॉज अ मेम्बर ऑफ करंटली दैट इज एन एडवर्ब and its synonym is at the time or now hiking that is a noun and its synonym is going on long walks uh, in the natural places and uh, environmental that is an adjective of the surrounding atmosphere or uh, climate awareness that is a noun and its synonym is understanding knowledge nearby that is an adjective and its uh, synonym is close uh not uh, for near elementary that is an adjective and uh, its synonym is primary or basic kindergarten that is a noun and uh, its synonym is uh, children's garden mean uh, maybe nursery school uh, playground or a very uh, young children's school in this paragraph the writer is a student he studies with effort he takes active part in other activities other than studies okay padhai ke ilawa dusri sargarmiyon mein hissa leta hai writer his first preference has been getting high marks in examinations in school this is high uh, this is the important to him but uh, taking part in sports and other outside activities after classes has also been important these outside activities will make him a well balanced student during the years at high school the writer took part in games and competitions he won these awards the hair he won the kaid azam badge in scouting and uh, the who's who uh, quiz program the academic excellence award and the essay writing competition in, in 2011 so third paragraph is in order to gain an understanding of independence and responsibility i held several summer jobs in the preceding two years i also worked to help myself um, financially in a boarding school my first summer job was at the english language center my second job was at mcdonald's and my past summer job was at dk academy i'm thankful to all these institutions for these job experiences they have prepared me mentally and financially this is the important in a way that i am now more mature and responsible which helps me not to be worried about the future but to look forward to it so students gain is a noun and its synonym is get obtain understanding that is a noun and its synonym is knowledge or information independence that is a noun and its synonym is freedom responsibility that is a noun and its synonym is duty to do something held that is a verb and its synonym is kept or um, had preceding that is an adjective and uh, its synonym is last or uh, earlier financially that is an adverb and uh, its synonym is economically uh, boarding that is the noun and its synonym is for stay and food mcdonalds that is a noun and its synonym is a rice student for light food job experiences uh, as you know experiences of working or services mentally that is an adverb and uh, its synonym is in the mind or uh, intellectually mature that is an adjective and its synonym is experienced responsible that is an adjective and its synonym is reliable uh, and uh, worried about that is an verb and uh, its synonym is fearful look forward that is a verb and its synonym is synonym is hope for or uh, accept something
so students in this paragraph the writer did some jobs in the last two years there he learned how to live independently and responsibly and uh, responsibly zimmedari se he worked in a boarding school to earn money his first job was at an english language school his second job was at the uh, mcdonald's restaurant he worked at the dk academy in summer vacation he got a good job experience at these places so he prepared himself for life well after this mental and uh, mentor or mentor training or uh, monetary training this made him more experienced and uh, reliable reliable it has removed his worries about his future it has made him hopeful and satisfied so last paragraph is i am glad that i have got a taste of what the real world has to offer i have learned uh, many lessons from my public high school boarding school and work experiences i am now ready to learn many more lessons through my college experiences uh, although it has been tough i have succeeded uh, succeeded so far i am prepared to excel and make it much further in the years to come with my college education this developing positive outlook has given me the motivation that i need to become successful i never give up i am now uh, when i am that mind to achieve i shoot for the moon and land almost the stars glad it is a verb and its synonym is happy taste that is a noun and uh, you have uh, also know uh, taste zaika zok real that is an adjective and its synonym is actual experience that is a noun and its synonym is knowledge thought and thought although that is a conjunction and uh, its synonym is even or if tough that is an adjective and its synonym is difficult hard succeeded that is a verb and uh, it's uh, also you have to know uh, succeeded excel that is a verb and uh, it uh, do uh, do to more better than others okay outshine others dusro se behtar karna make it much more further uh, to do much more than this usse aage kuch bahut kuch karna developing that is a verb and its synonym is forming shaping positive that is an adjective and its synonym is that is useful or fine outlook that is a noun and its synonym is view attitude motivation that is a noun and its synonym is cause reason and uh, give up that is a verb and uh, its synonym is stop doing what i am doing stop struggling achieve that is a verb and its synonym is succeed in doing uh, something so students in this paragraph the writer is happy because he knows that the world can give him something he has learned lessons from his school and work he wants to learn more from his um, stay in college uh, college his college life has been difficult but till now he has succeeded he is ready to do better than others through his college education this positive attitude of his is the cause of his hope to succeed he can never stop trying to succeed more he has decided to get his high aim in his ideas he flies to the moon and comes down somewhere near the stars this shows his high thinking mean ke wo apne khayalat mein chand par ud kar pahunchna chahta hai और होता क्या है कहीं सितारों के करीब उतर जाता है इससे उसकी जो बुलंद सोच है उसका इजहार होता है सो स्टूडेंट्स लेट स्टार्ट ब्लॉक क्वेश्चन क्वेश्चन नंबर वन इज वट काइंड ऑफ पर्सन इज दी ऑथर आंसर इज दैट दी ऑथर इज एंड एम्बिशियस हार्ड वर्किंग वॉइस एंड कर्जिस पर्सन ही एज क्रिएटिव माइंड एज इट इज क्लियरली शोन इन देशन विद वैन द राइटर सेज i worked hard for the first place and earned it it's mean the writer is a high school student he has attended his school for several years he has studied and worked hard in the lower classes and now perhaps is in the 10th class 
एंड ही होप्स टू जॉइन कॉलेज सून ओके नेक्स्ट क्वेश्चन इज वट डज द राइट ऑथर वॉन्ट टू एम्प्लाय बाय मैंशनिंग हिज को करिकुलर एक्टिविटीज आंसर इज दैट दी ऑथर वॉन्ट्स टू मेक अस अवेयर ऑफ इम्पोर्टेंस ऑफ को करिकुलर एक्टिविटीज दैट्स वाई ही हैज मैंशन इज को करिकुलर एक्टिविटीज बिकॉज ही वॉज फुली अवेयर ऑफ द फैक्ट दैट को करिकुलर एक्टिविटीज गेव स्टूडेंट्स अ चांस टू बिकम अ वेल ग्राउंडेड इंडिविजुअल इट्स मीन द राइटर टाक्स अबाउट इज को करिकुलर एक्टिविटीज और एक्टिविटीज आउटसाइड इज कोर्सेज ऑफ स्टडी he wants to tell if he is a good at studies he is also active in social and literary activities and games in clubs and societies he also wants to tell that he is trying to have an all round developed personality question number 3 is how have these job experiences made the author more uh, mature answer is that these job experiences have prepared him mentally and financially to face the challenges of future thus he became more mature and responsible not to be worried about the future but to look forward at it too it's mean that uh, these jobs experiences have uh, uh, developed the uh, author's mind and made him financially strong yes he has become more responsible in his work and activities he is much more confident than earlier question number 4 is that what has motivated the author to participate so actively answer is that the urge for success and his developing positive outlook has motivated the author to participate in different activities so actively his motivation has made him a successful man that he is able to achieve any target with strong determination so students author's successes and awards in school and his income made him hopeful he was motivated by his successes to do better in college he was moved to be more successful uh, successful in life now start comprehension questions Quest question number 1 is what are some distinctions of the writer answer is that the writer is an ambitious hard working and intelligent person he participated in academic and co curricular activities equally and performed very well getting good grades and winning awards he learned much and got ready to lead a successful life so students some of the authors distinctions or awards at school and afterward uh, afterwards added are these he got an award in kaidi azam bait scouting uh, who's who quiz program speech making and essay writing competition for 2011 in 2009 in computer application geography and mathematics and the most encouraging student award question number 2 is how has the writer spent his summer vacation answer is that he held different jobs in his summer vacations in order to gain an understanding of independence and responsibility and also to support himself financially his first summer job was at english language center his second job was at mcdonald and his past summer job was at dk academy uh, all these jobs made him a mature person so author has worked in abro uh, boarding school he has taken jobs at english language center mcdonald's and dk academy he has got job experience money and hope to do better in college and life question number 3 is that what has he gained from his summer job experiences answer is that from his summer job experience he has gained an understanding of independence and responsibility these job uh, experiences have prepared him mentally and financially for his practical life so students uh, this job uh, may have made him more mature experienced responsible man sensible and reliable person and hopeful to do more better in life they have given him good income they have improved made better his thinking and uh, planning for the future Question number 4 is how are these experiences helpful to him in future 
these jobs experiences are very much much helpful for the writer in his future because his uh, this experience made him ready to face the challenges of future eagerly confidently and bravely so students author jaws experiences have made him mature experienced given uh, him money and hope and uh, improved may I mean made better in his mental powers now he feels confident and hopeful about his future in life in college uh, he is ready and determined to learn more and to do more better in college and life yahan tak ki sitaron ke darmiyan rehna chahega wo even to be amongst the stars question number 5 is that what kind of student is the, is the writer which of the uh, which of his qualities impressed you answer is that the writer is an intelligent ambitious and hard working student he has creative mind he thinks and acts differently to get success he has positive outlook and wishes to lead a successful life all of these qualities have impressed me because i also want success in life so students writer is hard working regular and punctual in his work active smart intelligent he is a bright student active worker and honest to do to his job i like his determination firmness and desire to succeed in rise in life thank you so much allah hafiz subhanakallahumma wa bihamdi